Hi everybody, this is Ainok. In this video, I'll share the most beautiful salt paste ramen in Meiyakaji. Let's go! Today, I came to Meiyakaji. It serves very clear seafood based salt ramen. As you can see, this ramen is really beautiful. Inside of a restaurant, it's like izakaya space. Izakaya is Japanese bar or pub. Ingredients of soup stock is listed on the wall. Ramen soup is from bony parts of fish. Today's ramen soup is from snapper, kongai air, bellic splendens, and salmon. This is a menu. There isn't a vending machine, so we need to order two shop stuffs. Let's check menu briefly. Kaijin serves salt ramen and spicy salt ramen. It also serves rice dishes, toppings, side dishes, and drinks. There's also English menu, so no worry about Japanese. Today, I'll order salt ramen meal. This is one of our table to have ramen today. Let's see what's on the table. There are jack, hand sanitizer, seasoning bottles, cups, chopsticks, and the menu. Water is safe serve, so get ready while I'm waiting for ramen. As I said, cups and jack is on the table. Manga is listed on the wall, which is about how to enjoy ramen meal in Kaijin. Number one, please enjoy your ramen. Number two, once we finish having ramen, put a rice bowl into ramen bowl. Number three, what we need to do is well sunk the rice bowl into soup. Number four, stock soup rice is done. Enjoy your meal. My ramen has arrived. Let's check it. This is shio ramen meal. It costs 1155 yen. It's about 7.76 US dollars. Ramen is really gorgeous and ramen soup is extremely vivid and clear. Let's see ramen in detail. First one is soup. This is so beautiful. I love it. Soup is really runny and it's light yellow color. Let's see other toppings. Sliced perilla and a Japanese ginger. Shred white leg are top at the center. This is mint chicken meatball. I'm a bit surprised that no chashu is in the ramen, but this is it instead. Another one is minced shrimp meatball. One is from meat, and the other one is from seafood. I'm excited to see the differences. Last one is noodles. It's medium thin noodles. This is because soup tasted quite light, so noodles are also not so thick. Seasoned egg is served separately. It looks really nice. It must be good. The rice bowl comes with ramen as a meal. It looks it's slightly seasoned by soy sauce, I guess. Let's have ramen meal. Please subscribe my channel. Itadakimasu. Let me have soup first. Look at this beautiful soup. We don't see this much clear soup very often. I get so much fish broth in soup. It must be tasty. <laughs> wow, it has very, very gentle taste. So good. As it looks, soup tastes light and so runny. It tastes so much fish broth. And its saltiness is really nice. Not too much, not too less. I can have whole bowl of soup. Next one is noodles. Noodles also look nice. It's really chewy, so nice. Noodles are made of thin noodles, but it's amazingly chewy. Ramen soup tastes light, so noodles texture is also quite light. Soup and noodles are well balanced. Let's have veggies. It's fresh, uncooked, so I guess it's crunchy. This is nice. As I thought, it's really crunchy. Various veggies are mixed, so it tastes refreshed, especially sliced perilla and Japanese ginger. These are quite rare to see as ramen toppings. Next one is minced shrimp. This is also unusual topping for ramen. It's really chewy and it's great more than I thought. It's so tasty and so much taste of shrimp. Fragrance and taste both are great. 
And next one is minced chicken. It looks slightly darker than minced shrimp. Texture and chewiness are quite same. And this is also good. Minced chicken is slightly harder and more meaty. As we can see, color is slightly different. I can taste so much chicken juice. It's so tasty. Shrimp and chicken, both are nice, but I prefer minced chicken. Okay, it's a time for season egg. Can you see the egg? It looks very nice. Egg yolk is really oozy, and egg white is also really soft. Let's dip it into soup and have it. This is nice. Egg yolk is overflowing when I hold it. It's close to taste flat, but ramen also tastes light, so it's well matched. I love this melted egg yolk. Are you waiting for water? Okay, I'll have it. It's good. Do you remember the last bowl comes with a ramen meal? I'll show you how to eat it. It's good and some sauce is on it. It's a little bit burnt, but it makes wonderful sound. This is the instruction manga that I showed before. I'll follow it from number 2. I already had ramen, so let's put rice bowl into ramen soup. One slice is collapsed and looks like risotto, it's done. It's called zosui in Japanese. This is zosui, it looks nice, isn't it? Let me have one. This is good. Ramen soup and seasoned rice are really good. Japanese tend to prefer to have rice with soup, especially rice in soup. We can enjoy ramen soup once again with rice, our favorite staple food. So, this is all about Meiya Kaijin and Shio Ramen. Kaijin is located in Shinjuku, so it's easy to visit. But it would be very busy depending on the time. We might wait during the lunch time. This Shio Ramen has very, very gentle taste. So much seafood stock is in soup, so it tastes brilliant. If you want something to taste like or taste of fish, this will be the best one. Ramen looks simple. But ramen tastes very complex and wonderful. Gochisou sama deshita. Give me a comment what you want to see. How was it? It looks very simple and elegant, but it tastes so rich. So much fish broth in soup. It's incredibly tasty. I have Twitter and Instagram accounts. Please follow me. If you have any requests, give me comments. Like the video and don't forget to subscribe my channel. This is all for today. See you in the next video. Bye!